various ways to help your husband with his anger more than anything your spouse needs to realize that you are on his side that you are not against him you have to talk and communicate more than you most likely think is essential that you acknowledge him and cherish him despite the fact that you may not be happy by some of his practices or reactions separate the activities from the man affirm the man his quest for peace might start sooner in the event that he realizes that you are fulfilled by him and willing to stroll through the progressions of healing be his friend not his mother a man does not require a mother during his time of anger he needs a companion who will treat him and demand being treated by him as an equivalent he needs a companion who will steadily share life's obligations to him yet not start living his life for him somebody who will energize him in his critical thinking yet not take care of the majority of his issues for him on the off chance that you wind up assuming a mothering part to the man in your life he will never completely idle with the reasons and emergencies of his anger the frightening young man will whimper and object until you improve it at all you can move from mother to companion in his life by affectionately setting in his grasp those obligations and issues that he ought to manage value him don't nag him it's assessed that upward of 90% of men today are miserable and angry in their business to some degree the greater part of them feel lucky to be working they regularly mull in their deadlock employments feeling less than completely manly on the grounds that they are not in control of their own lives it's presumable that a noteworthy segment of a man's annoyance springs from a feeling of absence of control in his work pestering him to buck for advancements or asking for raises might just exhilarate his resentment pestering him for a large house or car will just develop a dissatisfaction that he has no more control at home than he has at work in any case on the off chance that you turn into a well spring of gratefulness for the work that he does and the living he gives you you will lift a percentage of the weight from his life find numerous approaches to say i value that you buckle down at your employment and that you hold tight notwithstanding when it's disappointing and extreme attest him don't criticize him a few men are resentful on the ground that they should work for another person but due to the sort of work they should do if your man is battling with being bolted into an occupation that is offensive to him you can facilitate his battle by insisting him for who he is and what he does compliment him for the character qualities he works out in his occupation persistence diligence determination inventiveness and so forth in all that you say to do let him realize that he is the best deco producer on the planet value him for the exertion give him space don't crowd him the vast majority of us does not want to be pushed particularly men it is an attack against their battling manliness and just serves to fuel their outrage they feel scared on the grounds that their wives cannot acknowledge them the way they are they feel subpar in examination to the perfect man their wives are harassing them to turn into at the end of the day they are not in control of their lives give your spouse a lot of room demonstrate him that you are worried about him and that you adore him tell him that you are there to hear him out and converse with him trust god to work for your man's great in the circumstance permit him to utilize the unfading magnificence of the delicate and calm soul in you to energize and help him as you supplicate it's imperative to petition god for your spouse's heart that it will open at all that he needs to comprehend so as to bring his annoyance back inside sound limits pushing your man to tackle his indignation might make him roll out some careless improvements to get you off his back however weight from you isn't liable to create an enduring arrangement when you venture back and give god space to work the progressiveness may be critical and preserving give him time don't rush him 
we live during a time of intense delight we can travel a huge number of miles in an hour we can execute business in seconds with our fast pcs phones and link shopping channels we would rather not hold up this subliminal earnestness we all offer for quick result might act as a burden on the other hand with regards to the procedure of helping a man diffuse his indignation change does not occur overnight it might take your spouse weeks months or years to completely mend from the reasons and after effects of outrage in his life